Hello, everybody. We're in the Phasma lobby. Look at the great lighting from the update. I like it. Anyway, um, I am going to see what we're in for for a weekly challenge. And I don't know. If, well, actually, I don't know why I'm adding stuff because we're doing the challenge mode. Let's see. Hide and seeker. There's a very quiet ghost hiding somewhere. Can you find it? Brownstone High School. I feel like we've done something like this before. I don't know exactly what this means. But we're going to find out. Okay. <clears throat> Very quiet. Quiet, quiet, quiet ghost. I wonder if the power is on. Take a flashlight just in case. So, actually, I don't need a flashlight if we're doing this. Uh, we'll use these and then we'll... Uh, Let's take the shitty nice therm. And it's dusk. <clears throat> All right, let's see here. Do we have lights? No, okay. So I am going to peek and see, I don't see any cursed objects, so. Not hearing anything so far. I, I think this has been pretty difficult before. Uh, it might even be the one where... I'll go ahead and put this up here, why not? It might even be the one where they... where the ghost like really gives you no evidence. I don't know for sure. Um, and then your sanity never goes down, which makes it very difficult to figure out what the ghost is. Um, but we'll see. If you start losing your sanity, it's not terribly, terribly difficult. I've heard nothing, though, so far. Okay. Let's actually go back out, and we're going to get the um, other sound sensors. And in my opinion, since they've done, like, the Apocalypse and the... Um, I think Apocalypse is where they updated the uh, sound sensors. Uh, oh, God, and we got this anyway. Um the parabolic mic became kind of less impressive. So, yeah, our sanity did not drop at all. Okay. <laughs> I think this is, this is pretty challenging when I've done it before. So we've got to just kind of listen. I almost would prefer EMF in case it touches a door or something, and then we can kind of go from room to room or something. But let's see. Um, I'll go ahead and get this on. So we can kind of see. I don't think I don't think it matters. I don't think our sanity is going to go down. Um, still heard nothing other than the ambient sound in the game. Okay. Like, what would the sound be actually? I didn't, did I check underneath the stairs? It's late. It's been a long time, long day, everyone. I it's so cold here right now. And, oh, there we go, okay. And we're kind of not built for this cold. Uh, I don't mean, well, me as people, but I actually mean more just the heating systems and everything. And so, oh, 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 I heard something. I don't know if it was up here. Oh, right here, okay. We got a room. So... Let's go out the side here. Let's turn that on so we can see. And let's get <laughs> a uh, EMF. I don't know about our objectives, but I don't think they matter quite as much. I remember it being really stingy with evidence, too, because I think our sanity is not going to drop. I should probably double check for a cursed object, but I do not think it, there are any. And I don't know if it matters with the sanity kind of the way that it is, but let's see. Give us any okay. hunting abilities. So, like, the most difficult challenge in the game, um, I don't know if you guys have ever seen this, is actually when you use Friendly Ghost and try to figure out what the ghost is. Uh, without evidence, actually. Um, so you have to kind of try to use, like, some circumstantial behaviors. I should do that as a challenge sometime, but it's very hard. Okay. I 
thinking it's in here, the ghost, but we'll get we'll go get the therm here uh, to see. First of all, we'll double check for. Um, okay, here's what. Put that here. Let's do this. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Okay. Just seeing if it... And it sounded kind of... But I don't know that it was the MF5, so we'll double check. Did it get power? It seems dark out here now. Okay. Would you like to do something, ghost? Oh, okay, so we know it's not a mare. Very nice. So that helps, actually. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Okay. I'm going to move this book just over here, actually. Okay. Let's move this here so we can tell if it... Where is she? Jeez, okay. Wouldn't it be funny if I'm wrong about the... Uh, sorry, I was trying to see if that was an orb. It looks like it's just a glare. Wouldn't it be funny if I was wrong about losing sanity and my sanity is now completely gone and she's about to hunt? Okay. Actually, it would be very funny because I would appreciate that. So it would actually make this easier, I think. I'm going to try there. I didn't see orbs. So far we've just got UV, I think. Did I th see dots or is that just, I think that's just a reflection on. Did she throw something over here? No, okay. Just checking. So, oh. I'm trying to think of, so if we've got UV, okay, we could try to get a Pulte. Oh, you can't pick up a lot of books here. Forget about that. Uh, okay. Not a lot of stuff to throw. Let's try this again. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? So either spirit box ain't working for me or we're not gonna get that. Um, let's check temp again. It's like, this is like, everything's a shade. <laughs> I think that's kind of the idea here. Okay, where, which door? Which door? We wanna double check for fingy, or six fingies. Here? It sounded like here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's fast. Let me... I'm gonna... I mean, why not just see... I, I don't really think it would have orbs in there, but... Why not see if it does? Which door did it touch that time? I mean, I really think that it's primarily set to this room, but I thought I'd see. So, you know, it could be a Gorio. Let me like go get a camera in case it does a ghost of any We could rule out a It's no that, longer, right? like, like I, I don't trust at all. Like, I've had a few Hauntus where I was like, well, wait, it didn't get freezing. It couldn't be a Hauntu. Um, and that ain't at all what happened. I did not check my sanity, but I still think we're still in this no sanity situation here. Where was that? Oh, I got whisper. Okay. Okay, where's my thermometer? Let's check this again. A little cooler. 
where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? I kind of don't think it's going to give us that, but it's definitely throwing stuff. Okay, MF3. I'm going to watch for a second here to just see if I see dots. I have, it could be a Gorio, but so I've got a little bit of a sense. If you Sometimes if it's this big of a struggle, did it throw this book? Where was our book at? Let me see here. So if it threw a book, we can cross that out, right? I think it did. I don't see the book anyway. Where is it? Did I see orbs there, or was that optical illusions? Okay, I think it's optical illusions. Uh, I'm not so worried about this. Where is the book at? I just want to see where it is. I don't even see it anywhere. Did it steal it? <laughs> huh? Where is the book? Where is the book? Oh, here it is. Okay. I definitely did not do that. I think it threw it. I'm going to cross off ghostwriting. Okay. Could be wrong headed, but I don't think so. We're going to keep listening then for Banshee. That was weird. It sounded like a weird, like. Um, is it on? Why isn't the light going on on this? Is that working? Okay, can't see the light on when you have your UV on. Okay. Let me check this again. I'll just double check, but I think this is gonna be warmer. Oh yeah, by a long shot. Uh, okay. Just seeing. Where's my camera? I definitely want to have that nearby because if it's a could still be a phantom. Has not got the power yet, could be a gin. And honestly, EMF5 and dots are the two that I really am wondering about. Oh. Okay. Yeah, this is gonna, and especially if it's those two evidences. So here's what I'm gonna do. I don't, I actually think, assuming my, I'm having no issues, no mic issues, I do think we could cross Spirit Box off. Which that, if you do that, it, um, okay, let's see what that does here. Email three, yeah, through the book again, so definitely telling us don't, don't do that, okay. I'll try this again, but where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? So if it is Spirit Box, I'm really going to question here. Um, let me keep watching here. Dots can be very stubborn. If you, if you find that you're really having a hard time getting evidence next to a shade, uh, which we can't have a shade here because we got UV, um, and I actually think I'm going to take orbs off too. I feel like we would have seen orbs by now. Let me... I want to see what it threw there. I keep looking for EMF 5. That's why I'm... I thought it threw something. Maybe it didn't. Oh, it did. Okay. So we got EMF five, yeah. If you, so we're between these two, which I'm not really that surprised. Uh, I think this. I let me check for freezing again, but I think I'm gonna go with a Gorio on this one. If you find that you're really having a hard time for evidence, uh, where is my? Oh, there it is. Then um, it's a really good idea to go with a. <laughs> 
Okay. It's a really good idea to go with Agorio. And so my hunch is that this is Agorio. We just haven't seen dots on camera. It's being a little stubborn about that. Um, if you find like you're like, man, I cannot get any evidence. It, Gorios are tough because you're not dots are already hard to see. Then you got to see them on camera, which makes it even harder. And then EMF is hard, a hard type of evidence. And so you've got all three of those things working against you. Like UV, for example, um, if it, unless it's an obake, if it touches the door, you're going to get fingerprints. <clears throat> and so it's not hard to get. Um, and so it seems like in it looks like you kind of do this by process of elimination. We did get down to 90, so I guess you do very slowly lose your sanity. But I'm gonna go with Agoria. Um, somewhat possible it's a gym, just being real stubborn about evidence. But um, I think Agoria is a pretty good guess here. Let's see. Let's see if I got it right. Yes, yeah. It, it's just it's that, ready, like, please. why is this not giving me anything kind of a thing? Okay, so I don't imagine this will be this hard unless we got another Gorio. Oh, we got the new fancy spirit box now. Okay, let's go back. I think this time I'm going to do this a little differently. I'm just going to take in evidence. I, I was thinking I would have to really wait for it to do anything. I think I would, if if I had to choose, I think I would just prefer to have the main, the basics, the basic evidences here. So if you had to pick three, I'd pick EMF, thermometer, and UV, and that's exactly what I'm going to do here. Hello everyone. So as you can see, I am showing you a race through of this next thing, <clears throat> the next round that I tried to do of the weekly challenge. And there's a reason for that, which is that the second one was a complete bust and it was a nightmare. But I did want to, even if um, it moves quickly, I wanted to show you how difficult this game can end up being if the ghost doesn't give you any evidence if your sanity is at 100% and probably why hunts actually are helpful for you. So what happened here, if you could see, is I was just kind of going room to room, checking temperatures, thinking that the ghost would make some kind of sound, touching a door would throw something, just give me some kind of a bone as far as where it was at. I looked and looked and looked and looked and looked and looked. So then I decided to move to using uh, sound sensors. As you can see here, I'm still really trying uh, the therm strategy. Didn't give me anything. So yeah, moved to sound sensors, tried to use sound sensors, and it did not uh, yield anything either. Went and waited thinking maybe I'll hear something. You could even see on the activity monitor, which I think would have probably, I could think that was supposed to be my primary clue of what I was dealing with. Evidence wise, you could argue, I could have used the activity monitor to maybe try to experiment with the EMF5. Would have been really guessing though, because that was still a lot of ghosts to rule out. So I went back in for pretty confidently with dots thinking, hey, Okay, it's going to give me, it's got to give me something. Still going room to room. Should be able to see my breath somewhere. Nope. Waited. Look for sound. Only sound sensor stuff I was getting was ambient sound. And I looked and looked and looked. Even went into the bathrooms. Again, in the, in Brownstone, if you're not sure where the ghost is, it's often in the bathrooms. So it's a really good place to look. Still nothing. Still nothing, still nothing, still nothing. And so after all of this time of just wandering and wandering, it was like about 30 minutes of this, of the ghost giving nothing. Just ambient sounds, ambient sounds, nothing, nothing, nothing. Maybe an EMF-5. I Because of the EMF-5 thing, I picked a shade that was obviously wrong. It was twins, but... I was not looking forward to doing this challenge again because I thought, oh man, what am I going to be in for? So anyway, that was that was my second round of going through the uh, 
weekly challenge here of hide and seek. Uh, luckily, things turned around after that. So I was like, I do not know if I'm going to have the patience for this. But this shows if the ghost doesn't give you much, how hard it can be at 100% sanity without the ghost hunting. This game can be in a big map can be really difficult. So anyway, I wanted to show you just to show you how how difficult it can be. Luckily, it proved to cooperate a little bit more. So we're going to start with sound sensors here. While we're getting the breaker on, we're going to start with sound sensors. But I even use sound sensors, I have to tell you. So we're really going to try it out here and hope that the ghost makes at least a peep because it made it did nothing didn't throw anything didn't touch a door i mean to the point of where i was like is there really a ghost here okay so we got those two and these sound sensors are the good ones they can cover pretty much everything so um just so i don't forget to say it if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so uh hit the like button and also leave a comment uh, let me know what you're thinking of um, how things have been going so far on the channel and I've got some things coming um, I'm kind of trying to firm up some ideas here on how, how I'm going to do it so I'm kind of excited to kind of play with some different stuff uh, on the channel too so but I do I do value kind of hearing what people have in mind maybe I'll put like a little survey or something up so I was, you know, I have to say, I was, I've been really enjoying doing this channel so far, but when I, when I started it, and this is like me, like, so I will just, uh, dive head first into stuff. I didn't even get the breaker on yet. I'm going to leave the breaker off for a minute here. And so, yeah, I just dive, dove like head first into it and, uh, was really excited about it and stuff. And, you know, then I'd read like, oh, you'll get burned out. And I was like, oh, I won't get burned out like a new year's resolution this wasn't my new year's resolution i don't really do those but uh like a new year's resolution i was starting to feel like uh, oh i could actually i could get burned out from posting so much content um so i took a little like just a couple days off and uh feel a little more motivated again and so anyway feeling a little excited again to kind of do stuff i think part of it is like just you know playing i'm gonna really double check for a curse objects i don't think there are any it's wishful thinking i think part of it's just um you know playing just kind of enjoying the plane itself uh and starting to like put pressure on myself to release content so which sort of defeats the purpose of the channel which is therapeutic as in ghost game therapy ah you know see <laughs> so anyway um i'm just gonna so open door means i check the room which i checked every single room before when i couldn't find the ghost and nothing as far as even a dip in temperature in fact i might go to the van and see if i get a get any kind of sound or anything <clears throat> so anyway yeah it's supposed to be therapeutic but if i'm it's like just that practice of you know if you're not practicing taking care of yourself and doing therapeutic things for yourself then how are you gonna do that for someone else right so and no i'm not doing rupaul stuff just so you guys it's not a rupaul thing rupaul quote <laughs> I'm just saying, like, take care of yourself and in little ways sometimes, which sometimes it's like step back, reassess. <clears throat> so it was a good little reminder for me. I need that reminder a lot in my life. I don't know about, ah, yes. Thank you, water, 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 water. Okay, we're in business. Um... So it's one of these bathrooms here. Let's see. Oops. That was me. That wasn't the ghost. Not this one. Looks like it's this one. Yep. Okay. And not noni. All right. No 
thingies right now, but okay. So, yeah, that's the thing. I turned the sink on and off. <clears throat> Alright, I'm gonna go get some more stuff, thank God. Because I have to tell you, last night was probably the roughest thing. I was in here. I think what I'll do is I will, because I do want to show it, because I want to show how hard the game can be if there's no ev no evidence, no hunting. It would give me, it would have given me evidence if I had ever found the ghost room, but I seriously went through every single room, checked the temperature, it just was giving literally nothing, and I think it's just the stinginess of where my sanity was. Um, and it, maybe if I would have gone a second time, maybe it would have... Um, given me like a you know a low temp again but I was like I just spent a half an hour in here I'm not going to spend a half an hour going to every room again it, it was late was the other part of it but I think what I'll do is maybe I'll just do a speed sped up version of how torturous that whole thing was and my amazing reaction to it so um let's see here do we have here? I'm going to turn this off just to see if I see orbs in here. Sometimes it can be tricky to see orbs. So we're going to leave this here. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Where are you? Are you here? Okay. Look at how I place those dots. Okay. <laughs> just admiring that. Says, since the ghost can't hunt, I'm gonna take a dog break here and get let my dog in real quick. <clears throat> I think one of the what I was saying before, I think um, <clears throat> what I can do sometimes is I get real excited about newness. I've always been that way, and so I was like, oh, I'm having this new thing, and so I think. Um, I was like getting all you know excited about that, which I still am excited. I've got like you heard me say like I got a new idea and playing with some things, so that's me. I like the creativity and stuff. Um, just kind of, but I you know explore uh, just kind of forget to embrace the creativity part of it itself and just kind of enjoy that and let things flow a little bit. So nothing wrong. It's fine. Good reminders. Okay, so we've got a UV. And I don't know if I just saw a dot. Let me check the temp again here. Oops. Hello. Oh, freezing. Okay. Freezing. Let's check for orbs again, actually. I don't think it's just going to give us... Orbs. Maybe it'll throw the book and we can rule that out. Um, so let's see what we cannot get. It, so it could be a gin. Has not turned the power off yet. It could be, and uh, sometimes if it's real difficult, you kind of have heard me say before, it's like it's possibly a gin. Or it's not obviously not a Goria, which is our other one. And I think dots may be out. Yeah, they're out. Okay, let's take dots down then. They're so noisy. Uh, stop doing that. Okay. And I did not see orbs. Is orbs, other than a mimic, something we can have here? Keeps turning that on. Or is that next door? Turn that one off. Okay. Um. So we could have orbs. Let me just make sure it's not over here. No orbs over here either. Okay. Hasn't cut the breaker yet, however, I don't think that's a guaranteed thing with our dear friend the Hauntu right now. Um, obviously Ghost Rain is going to be a demon. Spirit Box would be, could only be a mimic, and I don't, where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Alright, I'm going to go next door. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Okay. So. 
you know, it, it is possible, I think, to maybe get a demon to hunt on this if you get if you had suffered enough ghost events. Because I, the first time I did it, um, I got down to, I got down to, like ninety percent. That's not going to be enough for any ghost to hunt. But, uh, but, um, I did get to. Uh, I think I think if you suffered like six ghost events, which would be kind of unheard of, then you probably could technically get a ghost to hunt. Okay, so I don't know. Let's see here. I don't. I really don't think it's probably gonna give us orbs. Let me just. I guess I'll see if there's orbs in these stalls. Uh, I don't, I don't think it's a haunt to so ghost writing what I'd be looking for now is hard evidence ghost ghost writing and uh, EMF5 are two difficult types of evidence I kind of think we're between a gin and a because I'm going to take orbs off and spirit box again assuming it's working let's see here touch one of these I oh it's a demon all right this one was easy okay this week good to hear this weekly challenge uh, episode we, we got to do one more to get our get our loot but this one was easy this one cooperated it wasn't hard to find it was touching shit it was doing shit um so not bad so we're gonna hope that the next one cooperates a little bit more like that because i can tell you that first time i did this it was not fun okay uh let's make sure we got demon I'm not going to worry about the objectives. We're really just trying to get the weekly challenge. All right, let's see. One more time. And maybe this time I'll try without sound sensors, although the last time I tried without sound sensors, I ended up regretting that. Okay. Yeah, a demon. Okay, so brownstone... And let's do the same thing. Um, this time I'm going to just take my typical early evidence right, items yeah. in. Take a look at the equipment and prepare accordingly before starting the investigation. And we'll walk around and see what we see. But who knows if it'll cooperate like it did there. That one was... Very easy. I just I'm telling heard you. a locker get touched. I'm not sure which floor. Again, if you're not sure, check the bathrooms. I feel like they almost always spawn in the bathrooms here. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so freezing. I will take it. Let's see if we have any UV. Yeah, just touch this. I don't think it's going to give us UV. I'll test one more time just to make sure. If it does give us UV now... We're most likely dealing with an Obake. Because again, that they um, give you intermittent UV uh, evidence. Thank God. I, I feel like I'm completely in business as long as I have the ghost room down. But if you, do, if you do not have the ghost room and that's primarily what you're looking for, you're in for a nightmare. Okay. So, so far we've just got freezing. You see that leaves a lot of possibilities here yet. And you're not going to get... You're going to get some ghost behavior. Like, I remember one of them I was able to ruin a mare because it uh, turned the light on. Um, may get the breaker, but it's also very unlikely to get... Is that an orb? I just saw an orb. Uh, why is the orb coming outside the room? Okay. All right. This is what we call a Fab Four. Okay, so we got freezing. 
orb. And we're going to do this to see. I just want to make sure that we can roll out. Well, we'd have to roll out UV. It ain't going to give us UV now. Okay, so no ultraviolet. I think it's safe to say that is not a piece of evidence. Uh, dots is going to be a URA if it gives that to us. Um, huh? This door? What door was that? This is a little laundry. Huh. I heard a, a stall. Uh, which one is it? That fits up. Okay. Let's. Okay. Ooh, I need to get. Okay, I'm going to put the dots in there. I just kind of think it's weird. It wigged me out a little bit that the dots were. Or the orbs were in the hallway. Okay. Let's go get Spirit Box. Ghostwriting. Is Ghostwriting. The Revenant could be Ghostwriting. Uh, Spirit Box would be. Gorio, or up uh, Gorio, on Rio, I mean. So, I'm not going to worry about a candle test because it ain't going to hunt. Um, very unlikely it's going to do anything like that. The main thing is trying to get evidence here. And these ghosts, when they hunt, they're really, for the most part, it's pretty easy to tell most of them apart. And they're going to be easy here. Uh, that's all right. Let's, I'm going to take a camera. We'll get some cheap easy picks here um, and if it's real stubborn with evidence um, we'll maybe assume that it's dots and it could be a URA and actually if it does a ghost event we might also be able to kind of tell if it's a URA from our sanity since we have the sanity uh, meter we'll see okay so Maybe it'll just give us spirit box and be simple. And then all my complaining about how difficult this is will go away. Okay. Let's just get dirty water picks. Because why not? Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Are you close? Are you friendly? Okay. It's an on Rio. Uh, all right, I don't have to worry about that too much. Oh, I guess I could get some pictures of these footsteps. Why not? Uh, let's just do that quick. Get easy picks. I'm not going to worry about the objectives, but we are done with our weekly challenge. Oh, thank God it was so much easier than that one, the twins one. Ugh. You know, when I was doing that thing with the twins too, I would hear... Like, I'd be like, I think I heard maybe a door. I maybe heard a little something get thrown. And so that kind of explains it a little bit, because it was probably happening, you know, in two simultaneous locations. But it wasn't anywhere where I was like, something definitely just happened. It was like, maybe in the distance something happened. But and then I had these uh, sound sensors on and nothing, 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 nothing. OK, make sure we got that. I'm going to have to do this one again. OK. We got it. We're done. We did the weekly challenge. We made it. Um, so anyway, that's the weekly challenge. Uh, thank you for watching that. Um, and let me know if you had a hard time with the weekly challenge.